the conference and you'll notice I sound a little weird because I now have a cold. It kept me up every hour on the hour last night. So I'm glad I went to bed at like 8 p.m. Got up at 7 a.m. Um, didn't get a lot of sleep. But I figured I'd show you guys a little bit around this resort. It's out in Breckenridge, which is a ski resort. And there's a lot of things to do here. I think it's going to be fun, especially when my family comes, because my kids and my wife are coming at the end of the week. And we're going to spend one of the days just going out and hanging out here in Breckenridge. So let me show you a couple of the places. <music> This week was a bit frustrating because, so I went to the conference and I told you about the phone and it broke. Here's my new one, the new Samsung Note 7. Hasn't burned on me yet, it hasn't blown up. Um, but when I got there, I was sick. I'm actually still recovering a little bit from it. Um, literally the first night and it's one of those things where like you run you go go hard go run 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 Get a lot of stress going on in your life family work all this stuff and then when you stop You're sick you were done and that's how I felt at the beginning of this week whenever I was at this conference I did not get the footage I want I didn't even get to show you guys the tennis court that was on the third floor of this hotel and take my racket or anything, but it was really cool and I didn't get a lot of these stuff. I, I lost all that footage that was on my phone. Today at work, just so much frustration that was happening when I was there. A lot of things completely outside of my control that I just could not handle. And I think the one thing that I wanna take away from this whole process, and, and I don't necessarily deal with frustration bad, but the culmination of everything that just compounded in today, <clears throat> it was a lot, it was overwhelming to the point that I asked some of my friends to pray for me. I think really for me that's the big thing. And I, the one scripture that comes to mind with that is 1 Thessalonians 5, 18. It talks about give thanks in all circumstances. So I had, that's what I have to do. Um, I know that for me when I get really frustrated with life, I want to take it out on someone. I'm not necessarily sit there and yell and scream or anything like that. But I just, you are the source of my frustration. And so... Just gotta let that go, a lot of, gotta move forward. I got a new phone, having a lot of fun with my family when we were in Breckenridge and then went up to Denver. Gotta eat some good food, walk around and do a lot of fun. As you saw, I got to be, spend some time with my son building a fort. And I wanna show you just a little ritual that we have whenever we get to bed and uh, read some books or we actually watch some YouTube videos as well. Just have a lot of fun together. So encourage you guys, if you guys have frustrations, to just let it go. Give thanks even in those situations as well. So I will catch you guys next time. Bye.
Guys, this has been a pleasure playing with you. I'm going to end it with this win. Maybe it was still a fluke, but I've got the wins in. I like this deck. It's much more tempered. Uh, you, you